All right. Back, back for Blood has been revealed. The uh, creators of Left 4 Dead, Turtle Rock, have uh, revealed this at the Game Awards, which, you know what? I think I'm the only one here that gives no, a flying fuck no. about no. Left 4 Dead. Of course which not. I, I love me. Left 4 Dead. Damn, wow. Get blown out. I was glad that they got out of balance. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. Wait, wait, wait. No, no. every time I brought up Left 4 Dead before, everyone else is silent. Now you're coming out of the woodworks. Now now that your savior I is born. I, been here I was there from the beginning. I have been here before. I don't That's know true. I, I will give T Man credit. He's never been here. <laughs> I, I I forgive T Man. I'm gonna for, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna stop you right there. Right there and I'm gonna give you I'm gonna give you this little uh, this little ditty, and that um, assumptions make an ass out of you and me. So <laughs> you're not my uncle, Corey. It could be. All I'm saying is I've been playing Left 4 Dead 2 consistently since it came out, mods and all. And I tell people like, look, it is a if you have a Steam account, it is a fucking requirement that you own Left 4 Dead 2 because it goes on sale for like 99 cents mm-hmm. all the goddamn time. I need, I need to ask, so though, it, how did anyone here get into the alpha that they had? I did. Okay. It was amazing. Can talk about that like, I am jelly. really, really quickly. How did you like it? Because I I, I, I read so that I a lot of people said that it was good, it is, but that it definitely needs more like work. I mean, it's an alpha, so it is what it is, but it, it is the follow-up successor to uh, Left 4 Dead that... Um, or, I'm sorry, not, not sure I said it, The spiritual successor to Left 4 Dead that we've been needing for... What Left 4 Dead 2 came out 2009, mm. so 11 years, 10 years uh, at the later part of this year. But yeah, it's okay. it's damn good, and uh, it's a requirement that everyone on this panel buys it and plays it. With <laughs> Did me. you? See, well, we have to organize what console? Mandatory. Number one, number yeah. two, because I PC no, PC I'm for not mods. Because um, I don't have a good PC. <laughs> Crossplay. Oh, Crossplay, then that's fine. Um, did y'all see these people getting really mad? Be like, I can't believe they're ripping off Left 4 Dead, and this is so terrible, and Valve should be so mad. <laughs> and then people just being like, are, are you fucking serious right now? <laughs> it's it's not like Valve's going to do anything with it. Come on. Exactly. Yeah, it's it's also the same Valve. studio, just being like, hey, we're, we're out of Valve's fucking like, control. Now we're actually making a game we want to make. Mm-hmm. Let's see. Um, there was a trailer for Dragon Age Four. Anyone? Yes, any I have many feelings, that, but I'm not going to go into all of them because we would be here forever. All I'm going to say is, if Varric is back, Bioware let us romance him for the love of fucking God. It's been three, two games, two and a half games, and also D- D- Solus is a dumb egg, and I want to push him off. Just shove him in crap. I, I have to ask, based off your track record of uh, adoring problematic is fictional problematic. men, is Varric a good boy? Varric is wonderful. Varric's a good boy, and Bioware's just never let us romance him. But um, I'm very interested to see how they tie in save files from Inquisition, especially since it's going to most likely be like a PS5 exclusive. Uh, I'm, that's all that I'm interested in, and like how they're going to do that, because this is a full on sequel to it, to like Inquisition. So, and I'm like 99% sure that what you chose in Inquisition is going to matter in this. So I'm very interested to see how they do it. And I can't wait to see all the new party members and who I'm going to smooch. And that's it. I'm very excited for <laughs> Jack Mage. I, I love that franchise with all of my heart. And I'm just excited to see the like new directions that they take it in and everything. All right, I'm banking on Corey and uh, and Sarah for this next one. Uh, Evil Dead, the game announced. Jose, I'm offended right now. It's a, yeah, uh, I'm offended. Well, I don't know your I don't know your movie history, boy. Oh, yeah, Evil, Dead. Dead. Just, man. Evil Dead, the game, got you. Okay, it yeah. looks fun. It looks it fun. Great. I mean, it, uh-huh. it just it's everything. It's a game that honestly you really shouldn't take too seriously and just have fun with it like it's, yeah it's, especially since it has characters from like every movie including the 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 like new one yeah the tv uh, yeah, show like TV show the, uh, army army of darkness and the new like re reboot movie which is the yeah. 2013 it's one oh, wow yeah it's, it, it 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 has uh what's her name's brother the like oh uh, i would rather have what's her name yeah, me too. Wait, what about the me show? Too. What about the show? Did we? See uh, the show? I think the chick from the show. Yeah, it has the. Uh, yeah. Ke- what's what's her name? Kelly. Oh, that's good. I think mm-hmm. isn't it? Yeah, the chick. I would take her, or Pablo. The, show, the brother from. Pablo is a the, sweet boy. The brother from the new movie, the knight from the end of Army of Darkness, and then mm-hmm. Ash. So this, so this is throwing canon out the fucking window. This is, and I'm here for it. 
This is interesting, watch it, though. Watch when it be a sequel can, to the TV show, though, because right. Sarami is fucking nuts. Yeah. <laughs> when you guys can, there's a... Uh, I, I managed to see it in February before all this shit went down. Um, before the before times. Um... There's a musical that they put on. I'm not sure I how far it. across the it. United States they go. Yeah. Yeah. What's the one in San Jose? I, I, it was fucking it phenomenal. I missed I was it when it was in New York, and I've never regretted mo- anything more in my life. I was in the splatter zone, so, so I good. got hit with fake with fake blood the entire thing, and it was amazing. Mm. <laughs> it, was, it was a lot of <laughs> fun. Dumb, but like the good kind of dumb. I'll say this much. Um, it's interesting that this game is, is becoming... Uh, or becoming into fruition. I'm not even sure that's a real sentence. Um, or coming into fruition. I'm sure Ash would call you a nerd for using <laughs> yes. that. Um, but no, because because Ash is also licensed by Dead by Daylight. So it's like I don't know the legalities behind it. I'm sure they had to they had to cut a deal or something with the studio that makes Dead by Daylight um, because they already have Ash licensed, but. You know, I'm not. I'm, I I would assume it's not an exclusive not, license. No. It also you looks like they have the Ash from. Oh, I don't know about that. I know that um, like Dead by Daylight has Ash specifically from the the show, while this Ash seems to be either either from uh, either from Evil Dead Two or from uh, Army of Darkness before he gets his like armor and shit. Yeah, so it's like it's totally different entities, I guess. In yeah. that sense, yeah, two different entities. I'm just, I can't believe this game exists. Like, when literally when the trailer happened, me, I remember be, just saying to Sarah, like, I nobody asked for this, but I wanted it. And I, yeah. I didn't know I wanted it until I saw it, because I never expected something like this. I wanted this. Uh, the company working on the game is a, a Saber. Okay. So then, Saber Interactive. The last, the last thing they did was the, uh, was a World War Z. Oh. Oh, okay. Uh, so that then, makes yeah. sense. So then, because I only saw the trailer like once, and so then, what kind of like gameplay is it? My guess, it's going to be a World War Z style. That's just my guess. World War Z is a World War Z is a hell of a game. Yeah, so I'm more than confident through, like, that it's, it's going to be every competent. Evil Dead movie, including Army of Darkness, and including the TV show. God, I hope because... we go through Army of Darkness. I really <laughs> hope we go through <laughs> <laughs> shoot skeletons. Yes. Shoot skellies. That's the thing I haven't even thought of. Is like we so we know it's going to be like a Left for Dead like if it's going to be from that studio who made the World War Z thing, and it also just looks like a Left for Dead like anyway. But like I'm just sitting here like man. Now that you mentioned that, like oh yeah, because if they have like actual narrative levels, how is that going to be? Like are you going to have like the Army of Darkness chapter and you're just like mm-hmm. knocking over zombies and skeletons and like using like melee but also like shooting them because you have guns for no reason. 